All right, what up, though? Welcome back to the channel, man. Um, Blake Griffin has been bought out. Officially, he is gone. So, which also means the, what was it, the 30 million for next season is also gone. <laughs> but, um, yeah, Blake Griffin's been bought out of his contract. We are officially done with the Blake Griffin era in Detroit, which also means most likely he is heading to L.A. That was all. That was the main thought in everybody's mind. Blake Griffin will head to the L.A. Lakers on some type of minimum deal. Um, yep, I, I kind of like it, but I kind of don't. But at the same time, for me, it's it's the simple fact that um, you know what I'm saying we're not even really going to be using him like that for real. You know, I mean the money. You know what I'm saying we're not using that money for real, like. I feel like the Pistons, I feel like we have a good team. You know what I'm saying? I don't feel like we really need to add free agents for real. And I know, call me crazy, but you know what I'm saying? It's just, this is how I feel about the whole situation, man. You know, um, oh, Blake Griffin, dog. It's, we're finally done. I'm, I'm happy about that. I honestly am. Um, and it's also, it's also the fact that, you know what I'm saying? We we just got we just got to get things going. We honestly have to get things going because we don't we 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 didn't need the money. We really did not need the money at all. And I feel like what we could do is just focus on the team, focus on the young guys, build them up. Money wise, we weren't going to be using it anyways. I just got to keep reiterating that because I'm still mad. It's $30 million for nothing, man. But um, it just put, it just puts us now in an interesting predicament uh, cap space-wise. You know, um, I got to go look at I got to go look at the books. Hopefully, we don't have any. Um, hopefully, we don't have any players that need to be re-signed because if we have players that need to be re-signed, it's going to be very unfortunate for us. You know what I'm saying? Uh I just, I just hope we can, I just really hope we can make some shake, cause that's what we real, that's what the Pistons really need right now. Um, we looked horrible in last night's game. Um, we just couldn't, we just couldn't, <laughs> we couldn't score. We couldn't do what we needed to do, man. And um, I just honestly feel that it, it, it comes, you know, growing pains and whatnot, but um. Yeah, I just wanted to give that quick little update. But watch for Blake Griffin going to the Lakers. And if I'm looking at any other teams that could possibly pick up Blake Griffin, maybe. Um, who would I think about? I don't know about Brooklyn because it, it for me, it makes absolute zero sense for Blake Griffin to go to Brooklyn for the simple fact that their defense is already horrendous as it is. You know what I'm saying? So why... Would Brooklyn want to pick up Blake Griffin? He's not good defensively. He's not at all. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, what's another team that I can think of that could pick up Blake Griffin? So that's tough. I, I I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Um, we'll 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 figure it out uh, along the way. You know what I'm saying? Um. Yeah, that's all. I, that's pretty much all I wanted to say today, man. We're finally free. We are finally free. Thank the Lord. We are free from this Blake Griffin fiasco, and we can finally start focusing on the rookies. You know, like Seku. Seku had a real. He had. He had a good. He had a good game last night, man. Apart from a lot of other players, he had a good game last night. Um, and one other thing to watch out for is watch out for the rumored um trade for Jeremy Grant. Jeremy Grant may be getting traded at the end of the se I mean at the end of this buyout as well. Um it's still rumored that we could possibly be doing um, you know, first round pick or two from Boston for them to get that firepower. But at this point in time, it's Vucevic versus Jeremy Grant. And personally I see Vucevic going to Boston before I see Jeremy going to Boston. However, you know, as a Pistons fan, I want to see more first-round picks, especially in this draft. 
if we can get more first round picks out of this upcoming draft, oh man, the world is ours. We we are going to the playoffs. It is just gonna be a great time. I'm gonna catch y'all later, man. If you're new to the channel, make sure you like, share, subscribe. Peace out.